Traditional organized crime activities in Las Vegas centered around the casino skim were largely eliminated by the mid 80s through a combination of local and federal law enforcement. But there were still some remnants as became apparent in early 1997 with the violent demise of a man who had not been in the news for many years. Not since the days when Herbert Fat Herbie Blitstein was best known as a friend and associate of the notorious Tony the Ant Splatoro. Blitstein sort of became his right hand man. They ultimately opened the uh, jewelry store. Mob Museum content director Jeff Schumacher says Spilato was in charge of protecting the skim, but also had ideas for street rackets. We can get involved in bookmaking, uh, loan sharking, fencing stolen goods, robbery, burglary, etc. In 1981, several of Spilato's crew, known as the Hole in the Wall Gang, were caught in the act of a burglary. But Blitstein remained free until a 1985 credit card sting operation. Officers working in teams of three swiftly worked simultaneously to arrest 28 people and search a number of businesses and residences. Close friend of Anthony Spilatro, her Blitstein, was also arrested. He allegedly made a purchase with the bogus cards. Between the bust and the trial, Spilatro was murdered in Chicago, but Blitstein still had the association. Did you do anything differently, Herb? He has no further comment. Uh, he was sentenced to prison, uh, five years in prison. He ultimately served about four of those years. By the mid-90s, Blitstein again had some small-time rackets working, as well as a legitimate business, and he auto repair on Fremont and have been targeted for entry into the black book of persons excluded from gaming establishments. What we call notorious and unsavory reputation um, due to his, um, he had additional arrests that didn't result in convictions. The campaign was moved when in January of 1997, Blitzstein was found shot to death in his Las Vegas townhome. These Buffalo and L.A. mobsters were behind uh, uh, Blitzstein's murder and they really, they just wanted to take over his illegal rackets in Las Vegas. Ultimately, two men were actually convicted of killing Blitzstein. Uh, Anton Davey was released from prison in 2015. Richard Friedman is set to get out next year. Five other men were convicted of being part of the conspiracy. Paradoxically, the man they called Fat Herbie had lost a lot of weight by the end. Herbert Blitzstein was 62 years old.